Hello guys, this is Mridul Singh. Today I am going to show you how to format the Fortinet. Now uh, I have Fortinet ATC model, and I am going to format and uh, upgrading the firmware of that. Here is my Fortinet ATC, and the basic requirement of formatting the firewall is first you have to download the image file uh, for the Fortinet uh, it is on .out file and you need TFTP server and putty and I have connected my firewall with the console port and make sure that you have connected LAN also okay uh, and I have kept my out file on the E and now I'm going to configure the TFTP server in that make sure that you have selected your LAN I have given the IP address 192.168.1.100 I'm just showing you I have configured 200 and default 99 by default when we are going to format the Fortinet by default IP is Fortinet is 192.168.1.99 you can change it also uh, and my LAN card is uh, of Realtek PCI so I have selected that one and now I'm going to select my out file that is image file of the 14.8 c you can check it from the so directory here it is now I'm going to copy that now open your putty select serial open it login into tab Now I am going to ex uh, reboot my firewall. So the command is execute reboot. Select yes. Now it is booting. press enter for configuration menu now first format your boot device so for that you have to select the F now I'm going to press F it's asking for continue so I'm using yes now it is formatting that Now select B and B is for boot the backup firmware. No, sorry, uh, I'm just selecting uh, get firmware because we have formatted that. So select G, it is asking for the TFTP server, and we have selected our local network. So we enter 192. 
and it it is asking for the local uh, which is for firewall so 192.168.1.99 press enter and we have copied that from the tftp server the path of dot out dot out file so right click on that and press enter now you can see that tftp is sending the out image file to the fortinet It will take some time now it is asking for uh, saving the firmware we, uh, we are going to use default for default uh, we have to press D so I am selecting the D we can use B also for the backup firmware but generally we use default now it will take some time to configure As you can see, uh, uh, the he uh, the firewall started the system maintenance and scanned the formatted partition. And now formatting the shared data partition. Here we go. Now we have successfully formatted our <coughs> data partition, and firmware is successfully uploaded now login to the account the default password is blank so press enter now I'm going to show on on web page blank We are able to successfully log in into the Fortinet firewall. You can restore your config file from the from here. And if you want to create new policies, so you can create the new one. So we have successfully formatted and up updated the firmware of ATC. Thanks for watching my video. If you have any query, please mail me or message on the below description. Thanks.